truck kettle review time. It has arrived, it's taken a couple of days, but it has been delivered. So uh, what we're gonna do is sort of a real world test on it, uh, a few of the bits about it, and you can sort of make your mind up if you want one or not. So here it is in the box, the DC 24 volt auto kettle from Roadstar. So no doubt in its credentials, it holds 0.8 liters, runs at 24 volt, and has a 2.7 foot power cord. Now in the DAF XF, you have a 12 volt charger point here, obviously for your phones and that, but you also have the 24 volt Hella socket. Now the kettle itself only come with the cigarette lighter type, but I have got this Hella socket to sort of cigarette lighter adapter. Now it has worked in the past. I don't see why it shouldn't now. So uh, let's plug it all in and see if we can get it to switch on. So we've walloped some water in it, we've got it, I don't know if you can see there, just above the 0.3 mark, so the minimum. I don't know what, I'm not making the old site a cup of tea, I won't need it full to the top, but we'll run it like this for your average, I just fancy a cuppa. So there we have it, all plugged in, ready to rock and roll. The time is 9.03, let's fire it up, see how long it takes to boil. It's alive, we've got steam, we're steaming. Now, it is supposed to turn off by itself uh, once it's boiled. Maybe catch it on this, because it is on the boil now. Here we go. Well, that's boiled. Come on. Come on. Turn off. It's supposed to turn off. I just want to check, make sure it doesn't stay on while it's doing this. Oh, it did, it did, it turned off by itself, so we are safe there. So time-wise, it is now, oh, hold up, oh, God's sake, bloody watch. 9.12, so there you go. And there you go, a nice steaming cup of coffee. Now, most building sites now, the site canteens are charging us down south about £2.25 for a coffee now. So uh, the kettle was 24 quid, so it should pay for itself. It wasn't the cheapest, but it wasn't the most expensive either. Now, as always, boys and girls, make sure you unplug these Hella sockets because they do get hot. I wouldn't trust leaving it sort of plugged in all the time. Uh, but yeah, what was that, about seven, eight minutes? That's not too bad. You could whack that on while you unstrap or something and uh, have a nice boiled kettle when you get in. So there you go. Have a look at the box. That was on Prime, so I'm sure you can find it other places, but not bad at the price, eh?